Adventures in Homestead. And today we're working on another project. Uh, today we're building a template for square foot gardening. Um, we're getting ready to start planting seeds in our garden here soon. It's after Mother's Day, so the risk of frost has passed for us in Ohio, at least in our zone. I don't know about where you all live. So we're making a template. We're going to try square foot gardening this year. Uh, first, I got to get a one foot by one foot piece of board, and this is left over from the chicken coop upgrade. So I'm, not, I'm upcycling some of the wood that I already have. So my handy little broken yard stick I'm using as a straight edge. So I've already got some of my marks done. Uh, we're going to get this cut out, and then we'll come back and show you all the other marks we need to make. So then we can line up all the holes so we know where to put our seat. I got my board cut. It's one foot by one foot now. Uh, so we're going ahead and lay out our template on here so I know where to drill my holes at. Um, so we're going to mark every three inches. So three, six, and nine. We're going to do it both ways. So then I get a nice grid pattern on here so I know exactly where to drill my holes. this way so you could make this out of anything that you're able to cut and easily put holes in um, I just have plywood laying around I'm sure uh, some thick plastic or the I call it core plastic. it's like plastic cardboard you could probably use that if you want to use something lighter uh, whatever you have laying around I wouldn't spend money on one of these I know that people probably sell them online too but if you want to go that, that route too, there's nothing wrong with that. I'm just going to line up all my marks. I can see them. Yeah, I say so. I think he's in the backyard, bud. You already tried there? Yeah. Did you look in his room? Yeah. Well, he's not up here. I'll help you look in a minute. Okay, yes, hold on. So, I don't know if you guys can see it, but here's my grid pattern. So, now we'll go on and move on to where I need to drill the holes. So we'll come back once we have all that ready. So off camera, we went ahead and started marking some more cross lines in here so we could find the center of every square. Uh, right now, I'm just marking where I'll be drilling. So in the middle is your one plant per square foot. Uh, then on the outside of this inner square, you got four, which is your four plants per square foot. And then you gotta go through, and I'm, I'm drawing circles, because I know me and I'm gonna get lost while drilling. And these will be your 16 per square foot plants. So, those X's that I drew, they just help me identify the center for when I'm going through and drilling. So, this is really easy to do. We've never square foot gardened before. We've always gardened in rows and stuff. Uh, that's just how I was raised back in West Virginia. I don't think Colleen grew up gardening. No, she's shaking her head now. So we'll hop into me drilling all these holes out and we'll keep track of our progress this year and let you know how square foot gardening goes for us. Hi! <laughs> I don't find you why yet, huh? Yeah, I found him too. So I got all my holes drilled. Uh, these are half inch drill bit holes. Um, when using this style of drill bit, there is one issue and I'm gonna have to clean up the back side. I got a little bit of splintering. So I'm just gonna go back through here and clean these all out. And then our template is done. So I'm back. I've got all my holes cleaned up. So this 
square foot template is now done. All you do is you lay it in your garden and if you're doing one plant per square foot, you put it in the middle. Four, you'd put in these holes and if you do 16, you put it in all 16 holes besides the four and the one. So, this is done. I'm excited to use it. Um, if you guys like these videos, make sure you like and subscribe to Moss Adventures and Homestead on YouTube. And we're also on Facebook. Uh, we have just crossed over the 300 subscriber mark and we're getting close to 400 right now. So definitely a lot of people are liking these videos hopefully. And make sure you let your friends know too.